I'm gonna wake up. <laughs> no more weekend. Um, how is everyone? So today we're going to. Um, I'm going to be using the new class format. So some of you might have already seen this before. Um, and this class is about WH questions. So who, what, when, where, why, how, and it's a beginner class. So I see a lot of you guys are not beginner. You can still stay, um, but just letting you know that I'll be going a little bit more slowly today. Okay, um, so I asked a warm-up question for you guys. Uh, what's your name? Where are you from? And what's your favorite TV show or film? And why? So my name is Sam. I'm from Canada. And my favorite film is Titanic. So you might already know that if you know me a little bit. Um, and I like it because it's romantic and sappy and it has good cinematography and it's a good movie so that's my favorite um, so let's start with Omar Omar hello hi how are you I'm doing great thank you can you hear me yeah I can hear you uh, my name is Omar Kamal. I'm 24. I'm from Egypt. And my um, favorite movie, I think um, it will be Batman uh, The Dark Knight. It's an awesome um, <laughs> I love um, the series of Batman, of course, and um, I love Christian Bale. He's a good actor. His acting is perfect, I think. I heard that he is not going to be Batman um, in the next movie, whatever it is. Really? Yeah, I don't know if it's true or not. <laughs> rumor know. has it. But I think what is the rumor? That he's that if they do another Batman movie, Christian Bale won't be Batman. Wow. Well, actually, it doesn't matter. You're not going to see it anyway. What do you? Oh, another movie? No, I mean, he's wearing a mask. But <laughs> you you still see him a lot, right, Omar? Yes, uh, I love his acting. He's a good actor, in my opinion. I think. Yeah, I think so too. He's a good Batman. Okay, cool. Um, hi, is it Drizzle? Might be a microphone problem. Drizzle, can you hear me? Okay, I don't know. Um, all I hear, Strizzle, all I hear is static. By the way, I can't see anything on Colingo chat. I have to refresh it every once in a while to see what's your type. Oh, okay. Is it the same for you or just me? I don't know. Hmm? Try, I don't see anything but my own. Yeah, because <laughs> it's not working. Oh, uh, okay. It's not working. Okay. Um, let's go to the blue chat. Um, yeah, sorry, Jizzle, I don't know. Okay, it's your microphone. Um, I'll let them know on Facebook that the chat is in, and hopefully they can fix it. Okay, so hi, um, Joe Quim. I can't hear you. Are you muted? You click your mic. Joquim, can you hear me? Costa? No? Okay. Hi, Christoph. Hello. Hey. Could you um, answer the questions for us? Introduce yourself and tell us your favorite movie or 
Okay, my name is Krzysztof, I am from Silesia in Poland, I am a programmer and my favorite movie is uh, Die Hard. Cool. Um, a specific Die Hard movie or all of them? All of them. Okay, cool. Um, and hi, Louis. Louis? Hi, can you see me? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay. Oh, great. Hello. 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 Uh, my, name, my name is Louis. Uh, Joe Quim, I can hear you now. Yes. Fine. Yeah. I can't oh. hear you. I don't you can't know hear why. me? Mm. Ah, yes. Uh, sometimes. Okay. Sometimes. <laughs> okay, sorry. Um, go ahead, Luis. Okay. Um, my name is Luis, I'm from Brazil, and my favorite movie uh, is, I don't know, name is English. <laughs> okay, you can tell us in, um, is it Portuguese? Provado uh, favorito, the minions. Okay, I don't know what that means, but that's okay. <laughs> awesome. Uh, Maybe you should, um, you should watch it with, or you should try to find it, a version where it's dubbed in English. Do you know what that means, dubbed? Just, it's where they have an Just English actor. Yeah, they put their voices over top. <laughs> okay. Um, this be cable to me. Okay, cool. And hey, Louisa. Hey. What's um, your favorite? So my name is Luisa, I'm from Armenia, and it's, I have many favorite movies, so I'm not going to tell anything one. So uh, I will say, so I like How I Meet Your Mother and Big Bang Theory. That's my favorite one. Awesome. Yeah, it's hard to choose. Um, How I Met Your Mother is hilarious. I watched, <laughs> like, I, are there eight or nine seasons? I don't know. I watched all of them in, like, two months. <laughs> Really? <laughs> <laughs> um, cool. Uh, hey, Furkan. Hi. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Yeah, I always expect a question to be addressed. Uh, actually, there are a lot, like Louisa, but uh, specifically, like there will be blood. Uh, training day. Django. Yeah, that movie was awesome. We're going to be talking about Django in a different class. Oh. Uh, I think Wednesday, maybe? I don't know. I posted my schedule on Facebook. There's another class where we're talking about it. So what is this class about? This one? Yeah. Um, we're talking about Orange is the New Black. It's a new TV show that's coming out. Um, hi, Man. Um, hello. How are you? Good, thanks. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine, thanks. So, where are you from, and what's your favorite TV show or movie? Yeah, I'm from Vietnam, and um, my TV show, my favorite TV show is um, The Voice. Okay. Yeah. Do you, are you a singer? No. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know sing, but um, I, I like music. Yeah. Do you watch? Uh, um, what are some other singing shows like American Idol? Yeah, American Idol, um, um, American The Voice, and sometimes uh, X Factor. Oh yeah, the X Factor. Because yeah. Simon went on to that show, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I have so many favorite themes. Um, and I usually watch um, I usually watch uh, superhero movies. Okay, cool. You, yeah. Like uh, the Spider Man and Batman and yeah, all the and Marvel Iron movies. Man, special Iron Man. Oh, okay, so you really yeah. like Iron Man? <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. And hi, Orlando. Hi. How hi. are you? I'm fine. Where are um, you from, and what's your favorite TV show or film? 
Uh, I'm from Brazil, and my favorite TV show is The Ellen Show, and my favorite movie is Icky Pray in Love. Awesome. I love Ellen. <laughs> Me too. She's hilarious, especially when she dances. <laughs> yes. Okay. The, the program is really fun. Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, so, our topic for today, like I said before, was the WH questions. So, can anybody name them for me? What are the question words? You can say them. Who? Okay, who is one? Why? What? When? Where? Which? How? How. Okay. How likes to be different because it doesn't start with WH, but we put it in that category. Yeah. So, um, I'm going to go over the grammar skill, which is um, each of these types of questions and when to use them. And then I will read an article and then we will talk about it. Okay, so that's kind of the format for this type of class now. So we, I'll type them for you. Who? Who, what, when, where, why, how? Those are the standard questions. Um, so I'm just going to share this. It's a little bit small, isn't it? Let me make it a bit bigger. Is that better? Yeah. Okay. Let's start with um, Omar. Could you read this first one for us? Okay. Oops. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Um, who questions? Who question are used? Whose question are used to ask about people? Most who questions begin with who is or who was. Example, who is the new teacher? Andrew, Andrew is a new teacher. Example two, who is your first friend? Jenny, Jenny was my first friend. Good, let's think, let's, of, think, let's think of a few other questions that start with who. Um, so you could say, who is the president of the United States? <laughs> or what else could we say? Okay, bye Drizzle. Maybe um, we'll start with uh, Christoph. Can you think of a who question for us? Who is your daddy? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. And Luis? <laughs> Luis, could you think of a who question for oh. us? Who moved my cheese? <laughs> who moved my cheese? <laughs> okay. Maybe if you're working in a kitchen and someone comes and eats your food <laughs> while you're trying to cook. <laughs> okay. Um, Louisa, can you think of another one? Yeah. Who is it? Who is it? Yeah, who is it? So, like, someone knocks at the door and you yell, who is it, before you let them in. <laughs> uh, Furkan? Who dared to play with me? <laughs> Whoa. Birkin is in kind of a, a killing mode today, I think. <laughs> who dared to play with me? Um, man, can you think of a who question for us? Um, who is your favorite uh, single? Very singer. good. Yeah, yeah, good. Who is your favorite singer? Singer, good. And Orlando, a who question? Um, who is the single? Who is the single do you like? Can you repeat it for me? Who? Who is the single do you like? Oh. I don't know. Singer? Yes. Of, did you say a certain band? I couldn't hear you. Oh, that you like? Yes, do you like. It's correct? Yeah, I typed it for you. You could say, who is the singer that you like best? Or who is your favorite singer? Okay, thank you. Who is your favorite singer? Good. Um, and then we have uh, what questions. How about, um, hi Daniel. Hi, teacher. Hello. Good, how are you? 
fine. Um, how about uh, Silva? Hey, Silva. Hello. Yeah, sorry. Silva, would you like to read this part for us? What questions? What was that again? Could, would you like to read this for us? Would you like to read this for us? Uh, wait a minute, it's still loading. Okay. Uh, okay. Which one do I have to read? What? What question? What question? What question I use to ask people for specific information? Common questions are what do you do, what time is it, and what kind of music do you like, and what is your favorite? Example one, what do you do for work? Example two, what kind of food do you like? Good. So what are a few other what questions we can think of? Uh -huh. uh, maybe Silva, can you give us another question using what? What on earth are you doing, Furkan? <laughs> what on earth is Furkan doing? <laughs> yeah. You need to answer that question. Furkan, are you going to answer his question? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know he was asking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he loved. He wants to know what on earth you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> Eating pizza. Eating pizza. Uh, oh, I was going to say for breakfast, but I have to remember it's uh, you're seven hours ahead of me now. <laughs> <laughs> um, Daniel, could you think of a what question for us? What's your email address? Good. Good, good, good. And um, Orlando, a what question? Uh, what you do? What do you do? Yeah, and usually we, we ask that when we're talking about work, right? Or if someone does something terrible, you would... What have you done? <laughs> so, or what did you do if, you've done, if they've done something bad? Um, okay, good. Let's take a look at the next one. Where questions? How about um, Louisa? Could you read this part for us? Yes. Where questions? Where questions are used to ask about location? I need to read example too. Sure. The most common where question is where is? Uh, example: Where is the new shopping mall? Example two: Where is Los Angeles? Think okay. of. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> think of a few <laughs> other where questions. So, Louisa, can you think of one? Yeah. Uh, where were you born? Good. Where were you born? Where were you born? Um, Man, could you think of one for us? A where question? Um, where is your home? Good. Where is your home? Um, Louise? Uh, where, your, where is your first school? Good. So you would probably say, um, where did you first go to school? I'll type it. Oh, okay. Where did you first go to school? Or you could ask, what was your first school called? Like that. What was the name of your first school or what was it called? Yeah. Okay, good. Um, Christoph, I'm afraid to ask you. <laughs> <laughs> Can you think of a where? Where is my money? <laughs> where is my money? <laughs> where is my money? Good. <laughs> um, <laughs> Silva, you're back. <laughs> Birkin told us that um, he was eating pizza, if you're wondering. <laughs> Uh, okay, good. Um, okay. Let's go. <laughs> okay, let's go to the next one. When questions? Um, how about man? Would you like to read this for us? Okay. When questions? When questions are used to ask about time. The most common when question is when is. Is simple one. When is your next class? Is simple two. When is your movie starting? 
Okay. Okay. Yeah. Think of a few other when questions. So we use them for time. Um, Firkin, can you think of one? Uh, when are we going to get our money back? <laughs> so Firkin and Kristoff really want their money. <laughs> <laughs> When will we get our money back? When will we get our money back? Good. Um, Silva, can you think of a when question? <laughs> when? Uh, when do I have a chance to go to the outer space? Good. So you would say it like this. When will I have a chance to go when to I... outer space? Okay, typed it for you there. When will I have a chance to go to outer space? You could also use get here. When will I get a chance to go to outer space? Yeah. Okay. Good. Um, Samantha, I, I want to ask a question. Sure. Yeah. Um, when is Colin Wall going to charge? It is going to change on July 15th. Oh, thank you. So I believe that is a week from today. Let me double check. I, I think it's next Monday. Yo. Yeah? Yeah, it's a week from today. On Monday, it will be changing. Um, when it changes, you guys can still watch classes for free, but to participate, you will have to purchase the package. Okay? Um, and I'll make sure we have five minutes at the end of class uh, to answer your questions about that, okay? Um, all right, let's go to why. Why questions. These are always the most dramatic ones. <laughs> or if you're, if something bad happens, you just fall to your knees, right? Like, why me? Um, how about, uh, who hasn't read yet? Maybe Sham. Hi, Sham. Hi, teacher. How are you? Good, thanks. How are you? Good. All fine. Thanks. So good. Would you like to read about why questions for us? Yeah, absolutely. Why questions? Why questions are used to find out why something happened. The most common why questions is why is or are. Number one, why is this shirt so expensive? Why are men bad at dancing? <laughs> Good, Good question. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Good question. Come on, men. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, Sham, can you think of another why question? Yeah, why you don't want to, to go with me? Good, so it should be like this. Why don't you want? Why don't, yeah, why don't you want? Not why you don't want. Okay. Yeah, I typed it. So why don't you want? Or if it's in the um, positive affirmative, you could say why do you want? Yeah. Yeah, so that's just about the order. Why don't you or why do you? I'll type that. Okay, good. Um, Christoph, can you think of a why question? <laughs> why do you ask me? Why do you keep asking me so many questions? <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> ask somebody else. <laughs> Go ask someone new. Um, okay, what about uh, Luis? Could you think of a why question for us? Why Ferkel is eating pizza? <laughs> why is, why is Ferkin eating pizza? Because <laughs> it's delicious. Because pizza is delicious. <laughs> okay, good. Um, let's go to the last one. How? How questions? Uh, who hasn't read yet? I don't know. Orlando, maybe? Yeah, they can. Uh, how questions? How questions are used to find out numbers? How questions are they often followed by quality words? like much, many, big, etc. Example, how much is this, this church? How many sandwiches do you want? How old are you? Good. And uh, Orlando, can you think of another how question? Um, 
I think everyone, but have an in the example. Um, how many, how much is the is the book? For example. And how much is this book? Or you can also you could also say it like. How much does this shirt cost? Or how much does this cost? It's another way to ask. Good. Um, you can also use um, quantity words and adjectives. How tall is is your okay? How tall? How big? Um, <laughs> Uh, Daniel, can you think of one other how question? Yeah. Uh, how do you spell your last name? Good. How do you spell? That's another common one. Good. How do Good words for, or good phrases for class. How do you spell? How do you say? Very good. Um, okay. So now, we went a little bit long on that part, but that's okay. Um, I'm getting used to the new format for classes, so just bear with me. <laughs> um, so now, I'm actually going to read about five minutes from this article for you guys. And you have to listen. So this is a listening activity. And then afterwards, we will answer some questions about the article and what we've heard. And then we'll discuss it a little bit. Okay? So, okay. Um, I'll give you the link to follow along if you want to. It's right here. And I'll put it up on my screen. So, our oh. article. Oh, that's not the right one. Oops. <laughs> oh, it's the wrong link. Here it is. That last link. <laughs> OK. So it's called Netflix Releases Orange is the New Black. Um, if we have time, we'll watch the trailer afterwards. So I'm just going to read a little bit, and then we will talk about it. So just listening right now. Um, the return of Arrested Development has gotten all the ink and attention. But Netflix has another original comedy series on the horizon in the form of Orange is the New Black, a fish out of water and into prison story from Weeds creator Genji Kohan. And now we have our first look at the trailer. The series, which is based on the samely named novel by Piper Kerman, stars Taylor Schilling, Jason Biggs, Kate Mulgrew, and some other people, <laughs> as well as Weeds alums Pablo Schreiber and Michael Harney. Here's a look at the synopsis from Netflix. Created and executive produced by Genji Cohen from Weeds, and based on the U.S. best-selling memoir of the same name by Piper Kerman, the comedic drama starring Taylor Schilling follows engaged Brooklynite Piper Chapman, whose decade-old relationship with drug runner Alex results in her arrest and long-term, sorry, year-long detention in a federal penitentiary. To pay her debt to society, Piper must trade her comfortable New York life with fiance Larry, Jason Biggs, for an orange jumpsuit and a baffling prison culture where she is forced to question everything she believes and form unexpected new alliances with a group of eccentric and outspoken inmates. Here's a picture. Looks like fun, right? <laughs> um, d can anyone tell me what that means, penitentiary? A prison? Yeah, a federal prison. Okay, and I guess she's hiding in the bathroom. <laughs> um, I don't think your bathroom stalls look like that in prison, but I don't know. Maybe they do. <laughs> um, 
So we don't have time to read the whole thing. I'm just reading the first part for you. Um, how long is the trailer? Oh, no, it's a bit long. It's three minutes. But you can watch it on your own if you want to. Um, so basically, this is just the article that we're going to discuss. So it's a television show similar to Weeds. Um, has, has anyone seen the show Weeds? Yeah. What is it about? A mom is, starts cu starts cooking meth or no, not meth. Smuggling or mm, selling. You're thinking yeah. of Breaking Bad. Breaking Bad. <laughs> but, but there's a mom who is related to drugs. Not meth, maybe, but something. Weed. Maybe well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, um, I think Louise, have you seen this show? Yeah, a little bit. Um, so it's a mom who uh, her husband passes away, and then she starts. She somehow gets into selling pot um, to get money to take care of her kids. So it's an interesting show. Um, the writing is pretty good. I like the show. So the same writer wrote this new show. So actually I just answered my first question. Um, so I've got some discussion questions uh, for our, sorry, I have some discussion questions that are using the question words that we talked about before. So here's the first one. Who wrote this series? I want you to answer in full sentences, okay? Um, who wrote this series? Maybe, um, let's ask Orlando, who wrote this series? It's okay if you don't remember. <laughs> no, I don't remember. So okay, I so you it. say, um, I don't know who wrote this series. <laughs> I don't know who okay. this series. Did anybody catch her name, of the name of the girl who wrote the series? I took him. Yeah, mm -hmm. Piper Kerman, good. Piper Kerman wrote the novel. Um, so it says it's based on the novel by this guy, Piper. And then it's created and produced by Genji Cohen, the chick who made weeds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. And another question. What website is releasing this series, and when will it be released? Full sentences. <laughs> Netflix <laughs> release. Good. Netflix released, or is releasing, right? Netflix is releasing this series. In the next October. How would you say it? In next October. <laughs> You actually don't need the in. You can just say Netflix is releasing this series next October. Oh. Or you would say in October, but not in next October. So choose one or the other. Um, you can't. The, the Klingo chat was not working for us for some reason, Ling Ling. So we're typing in the blue chat. <laughs> um, uh, welcome. So Netflix, oh, I guess I better, I'll give everyone the document who's in Klingo chat, even though I can't see it. <laughs> Hopefully the people outside can. Uh, okay, good. And what will this series be, will this series be about? Let's ask Louisa. <laughs> Um, this series is going to be about a woman who will be in prison. Mm -hmm. That's all I remember. <laughs> okay, good. They didn't tell us that much, right? Um, so she's going to be in prison. They gave us a little bit more information. Um, Christoph, do you remember anything else? Mm. She was drug dealer and uh, she was de in detention in jail for this. Right. Good. Um, so she was in a relationship with a drug runner. 
Um, we're talking about this series, Orange is the New Black. Okay, and um, Shem, here's another question. Why should, pe why should people watch this TV show? So pretend that you are the spokesperson for this show and you have to explain what looks interesting about it. So Shem, why should people watch this TV show? Not through there, Sham. Maybe man. Um, I'm looking for an uh, answer. <laughs> Actually, I, I don't know. So I'll put it up. Put this. Oops. So here's some more information about it. Can anyone think of some reasons why people should watch it? What makes it interesting? What sort of people might like it? What other shows are similar? Of course, answers would contain Yeah, something. maybe we can say, like, this is such an unseen movie before. There will be a woman who will be staying in a prison for a decade. Then she will find a way to get out and to see what will happen to that woman, you have to watch the series. Mm -hmm. Good. That's always one way to try to convince someone, right? You get them hooked and then say, to see what happens next, you'll have to watch the series. I will tell you. Um, Luis, can you explain what you just typed for us? Netflix what? produces great series, like a uh, House of Cards. Have you seen it, House of Cards? No. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard it's really good. Um, also, Netflix just bought the rights to Arrested Development. Do you guys watch that show? I heard it. They um, create a lot of different. It's websites. hilarious. <laughs> it's yeah. Netflix just bought the rights to that show and they released the new season only on Netflix. So now if you like that show, you have to go to Netflix to see the new series. Um, do any of you use Netflix? We can. You can, but <laughs> it <laughs> takes some effort. <laughs> you have to use a VPN. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. I don't know. I did when I was in France. <laughs> um, but I can show you guys. Um, I don't know if you will have seen what it looks like. Oh, this you can't see it. What? Yeah, no. this, is what, this is what it looks like. This is my Netflix. <laughs> Recently watched. Recently watched, of course, is Dexter. <laughs> um, and then they give me my top ten. Um, but I'll show you what I meant about, or maybe we can find it. Oh, Breaking Bad. Here's Orange is the New Black, and it's showing us that, um, oops, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to play the trailer, but <laughs> it's showing us uh, the cast, the genre, and it's saying that it's raunchy and deadpan. <laughs> so you can search for things and they come up genres. It's pretty cool. It's uh, interesting. Um, so here's another question. I want you guys to come up with a few WH questions about this series or questions that you could ask about TV series in general. So, for example, you might ask, um, who produced this series? Or, um, how many years did it take to write this series? Or something like that. So, I'm going to ask you each to come up with one question that you could ask someone about a series. Um, Christoph, you're first. You can use any of the question words. <laughs> can you ask it out loud for us? Okay, why people watch uh, those stupid series? <laughs> okay, and who would like to answer? Uh, okay, Farkin? 
maybe I can say because those people got paid. The people who watch the series get paid? Yeah. Hmm. I watch series and I don't get paid <laughs> for it. Why? You didn't watch that one. Oh, this one. Yeah. So, um, he just said, why do people watch those stupid series? So, that question kind of means general series in general, right? Rather than that. If you said, why do people watch that oh, series? Then it means this one that we're talking about. So, just TV series in general. Why do people watch them? Maybe I can say, like, when we are bored, it's a good way to entertain ourselves by devoting, in selves, devoting ourselves into those new, uh, what can I say, <laughs> atmosphere, environment. Okay, so when you're bored, it gives you something to do outside of your own kind of environment. Okay. Um, Ling Ling. Yeah. Could you ask us a question? Just I know that you came a bit late, so just about TV series in general. If you were interviewing someone about their TV series, what would you ask okay. them? Okay. Uh, 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 turkey guy. Turkey guy. <laughs> Me? <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce your name. Furkin is right? Yeah. Uh, I just wanted to ask you uh, why people like watch this series. All of them. So you would say, why do people watch TV? Mm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think it's kind of like Kristoff's question. So how about we change it to something like this? Why might people watch this series? Yeah, let's ask someone other than Furkin. How about um, uh, Orlando? Why might people watch this series, Orlando? Oh, I think it because, I don't know, some people don't have nothing to do or some people need to start to, to follow, for example. Okay. Like friends, my favorite. Right. Okay. Um, good. Uh, so how about Luis? Why don't you choose someone and ask another question about TV series like this one? Um, why Come Along is cancelled? Sorry, can you ask again? Can you pull your microphone away just a little bit? Uh, why Come Along is cancelled? Why is which show is cancelled? Camelot. Camelot. Okay, so it would be like this. Why is Why is Camelot cancelled? So you, your verb comes first. Why is Camelot cancelled? Um, Louisa, why is Camelot cancelled? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> Maybe you can make something up. <laughs> oh, common law. Common law. Okay. Common Why is law. common law cancelled? What is it? <laughs> is it a television show, Louise? Yes. Okay. So, Louisa, why don't you just be creative? <laughs> Why do you think this television show was cancelled? Because people start to watch it less than before. Because? People start to watch it uh, what is less than before. Okay, people stopped watching it. Um, okay, good. Ling Ling says, I like vampire series. So maybe, Louise, everybody is watching True Blood. <laughs> so, yeah. So they can. I love it. <laughs> I love Dime, Diamond and uh, Nina. Yeah, it's a good show. Lack yeah. of viewers. Yeah, Kristoff. Um, bad ratings. Um, I don't know. Lots of I know. I know another TV series called Luck, and it was really good. But three horses died in the movie, so they have to cancel it because of the, you know, all the complaints. 
Okay. Um, Louisa, why don't you ask Shockey? Hi, Shockey. Hi. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Louisa, why don't you ask Shockey a, a question using the, a question word about TV series? When you are going to watch the series? Good. When are you going to? During the weekend. Good. So I'm going to watch this series during the weekend, or you could just say I'm going to watch it this weekend during the weekend. Okay. Good. Um, Firkin, why don't you ask a question to Ling Ling? Okay. What was the last TV show that you watched? Hmm. Let me see. Ah. Uh, oh. Okay. Uh, Broken Girls. Broken Girls. Do you know it? So you would say the last TV show that I watched. Oh. Was... Okay. Okay. <laughs> the last TV show I have watched the Broken Girls. It is uh. Is it uh, two broke girls. Talk about broken, broken girls. I couldn't broken. find it. It's goose. Oh, girls. <laughs> what is a goose? Yeah, girls. Girls. Yeah, girls. Broken Sorry. girl. My okay. pronunciation is terrible. Uh, two yeah, two broken girls. Okay, two broke girls. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. <laughs> okay, good. And, um, man, why don't you choose a question to ask someone? Maybe, um, um maybe Christoph? You could ask Christoph a question. Um, Christoph? Yeah. yeah what is fine. your favorite, yeah. What is your most favorite series? Mm, favorite series? Uh, it's Game of the Throne. Oh. Game, Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones. I have never heard about this. Never? <laughs> Maybe, yeah. Um, I've heard a lot about Game of Thrones, but I've never seen it. Uh, actually, yesterday, um, me and my brother's girlfriend, we were being lazy and like laying around all day relaxing and we decided to start a new TV show so we started watching Grey's Anatomy <laughs> have you oh. guys seen Grey's Anatomy? yeah we watched like 10 episodes <laughs> yesterday <laughs> we were just sitting there on our computers watching TV and being lazy all day so that's the last show we've watched um, Good. Orlando, why don't you choose a question for Louise? Um, why all the TV show is so boring? So, can you ask it again? Why? Why the uh, TV show is so boring? What? Do you, why Brazilian TV show? Ah, uh, okay. Why are, why are Brazilian TV shows so boring? Yes, why yes, are? Yes. Is that why it, are. Oh, sorry. Thank you. Okay, good. Why are Brazilian TV shows so boring, Louise? <laughs> <laughs> because, <laughs> because, because Global is sick. <laughs> <laughs> because what's <coughs> what's sick? <coughs> because so you would say Brazilian TV Brazilian TV shows are boring because TV oh trash okay because yes. TV Globo is trash you would just say it's trash it is trash, trash. okay or you can say Luis because it is so trashy 
because it's so trashy like this. What does that mean, trashy television? Um, the, the shit television. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like really not, it's not educational, um, yes, yes. kind of ridiculous, <laughs> oh. like blah, like what am I watching? This is awful. Like uh, Jersey so Shore. Has anyone heard of Jersey Shore? Yeah. Oh, that show is awful. It, that's, it's trash, I would say. It's so trashy. <laughs> okay, good. Um, okay, so who asked that one? I think Orlando, right? So, Shockey, it's your turn. Shockey? Yes. Okay, why don't you ask um, Huang? Hi, Huang. Oh, is that Huang? Oh, it's me. <laughs> hey, <laughs> I had to keep. Re I had to keep reading. <laughs> uh, good. Um, Shaki, why don't you ask Koyan a question about television shows? The the orange is the new black one. Sure, or just in general, it's up to you. Why is the series called Orange is the New Black? Good. <laughs> I'm sorry, my friend. I just came in. I have no idea what you're talking so, about. So, unfortunately, <laughs> Hoyan just joined. <laughs> so she doesn't know the series we're talking about. But does any can anyone else tell us why is it called Orange is the New Black? That's a really good question, Shaki. Uh, Firkin says her clothes are orange. Okay. Um... Why are her clothes, does she just love orange? No, no, because she's in prison and prison clothes are orange. Right. Mm -hmm. So, what, what does it mean, is the new, this phrase, something is the new something, orange is the new black. Um, this is a phrase that we use when we're saying that there's something new that is replacing what used to be cool. So I would say, like, everybody used to always drink tea, but now they drink coffee. So coffee is the new tea. That's the expression. So you would say, um, women used to always wear black, the color black, right? Oh, I'm wearing black. Look at that. Women used to always wear black, but now they're wearing pink. So pink is the new black. That's the expression. So they're using that in the title. <laughs> um, okay. uh, Hoyan, why don't you ask uh, Louisa a question using one of the question words just about television series in general? Yeah, because I don't know about all things. So, Louisa, what is your favorite? TV series. Okay. How I Meet Your My favorite TV series is How I Meet Your Mother, Big Bang Theory. Ah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. Good job, guys. Um, okay, so we have about just a few minutes left. I just want to ask you guys um, really good job with the question words. Does anyone have any questions for me? About the new Kalingo, it's coming yeah. on Monday. Forget. When am I going? <laughs> when am I going to get my mail discount code or coupon? I, um, I'll double check, but I think it should be coming sometime this week. So everybody so who has applied Lingo for is it, gonna charge for sorry? joining classes. Kalingo is going right. to charge for. Okay, how yeah. much is it? It's going to be um, $80 for a monthly package. For the first three months, you can get it for $40. There's a discount code available. Okay. Um, I'm just going to find my little spiel about it. Uh, Ling Ling, do you have a question? Yeah. Mm. I just heard that uh, it will be never free after July 5th. So my question is, 
when I pay for the fourteen dollars per month, uh, what about next month? Is has uh, um, does it uh, has some um, this this uh, <laughs> discount discount right? So that discount. fifty percent yeah. off discount it's for the first three months. First oh, three yeah, months. first three months. And then three after, months. Okay, after that, got it. yeah, after that, it would go up to $80. You know, um, um, I, am, I am in China, and the connection is so bad. Uh, it uh, depends on, you know, uh, I, uh, it is forbidden on China to, ha to get into the Google Plus, so I just uh, pay for the VPN. So right. I, I am... I am yeah, I am afraid of the, my suck connection. Yeah, it seems like it's fine when you don't have video. Um, like your voice sounds perfectly fine. Maybe, but some some days it can be good, and then other days not so much, right? So it depends. Yeah, um, does anyone have true. any other questions, Louisa? Uh, I, uh, can you yeah. say how can I pronounce a letter so you can write it in English? I mean, how can uh, I want to say a letter, so can you write that in English? A letter? Yeah, like M. How can I write that? M? M, but know. not M, like M. I don't understand what you mean. I mean, M uh, is pronounced like M, like this. Mm hmm. But I want, like, M is, M is longer than. Ma, yeah, ma, ma, <laughs> ma. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. we like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank okay. you. Okay, no problem. Um, okay, any other? Yeah, it's been free for about eight months, Ling Ling. Yeah. Um, okay, I'm just gonna give you guys my information. Big list of links now. Um, I'll put it in the other chat as well. And um, I will be teaching the next class as well, um, Texas. Me? Yeah. No. <laughs> Aren't you from Texas? Yeah. Do I sound like I'm from Texas? Yeah, sometimes I, I don't know. Really? Uh, no, I'm <laughs> from Canada. <laughs> I'm from a town near Toronto. Uh, I think I can make my voice sound like I'm from Texas. <laughs> 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 okay. Um, <laughs> uh, I'm teaching the next class. We're looking at the first conditional and pop culture. We're looking at an article about Twitter. So um, come join me there. I gave you guys a whole bunch of links. <laughs> so you can always send me questions if you have other ones about New Colingo or anything else, okay? Okay. Thanks, guys. Bye. See you Bye. soon. Bye.